Nothing soothes the soul or fires the imagination quite like the creation of something beautiful. We're just really empowering them to do their own thing and be creative and have their own voice. Seattle's vibrant Palette Arts Center brings the gift of art to people of all abilities. I mean, all of our artists are very unique in their styles and, and their art is, is wonderful in its own way. Um, and I, I'm constantly blown away when we're at the studio, what they're making and creating. People become way more confident in their abilities and, um, and just their ability to be social too. But when the pandemic put in-person sessions on hold, Executive Director Diane Knoll and her instructors took the studio online. Very good. The vibrant palette artists have been working from home on an ambitious new project. Cleaning up my uh, design a little. Nice. Every artist does something like that. Each painter is putting their own spin on a colorful array of lanterns. Wow, Mary, you've been busy. And here's my larger one. Soon to be shared with the public. I love the flowers. The project was conceived by artist Liz Tran. I want to engage with the community and and develop a project that they could have a lot of, of fun with. Hi, everybody. And, ah. Working from home can be challenging. What should I do? Brett, we can't see you. Yeah, it's really taught us to be flexible. <laughs> but the joy shines through. I can't even see you behind that lantern. <laughs> <laughs> made some beautiful, creative pieces. And it's going to be really bright and colorful, and everyone's adding their own way of painting them. Green dots and stuff all over. We're all supporting each other and having fun together. Finally, we've been looking forward to this day for a long time. The completed works are put on display in the Central District's Pratt Park. To be appreciated by the whole community. A colorful message for all to see. It exceeded my expectations. Art belongs to everyone. It's just really worked out perfectly, I think. Art is relevant no matter who makes it, and it needs to be seen.